Hello, in this video, we will see new bookmark navigator feature, which is added in November 2021 Power BI desktop release. On your screen, you can see three buttons, uh, category, model, and color. These three buttons are bookmark button using a new features. And if I will click on the category, I will able to see the total cells by category. If I will click on the model, I will able to see the total cells by model and similarly for the color. So in our demo session, we will try to create similar kind of report using a new bookmark features. So let me go here. I have a three graphs already. Now I'll go to the selection. In the selection, I'll increase the size and I will disable color and model and I will add a bookmark and rename as category. Now in the second one, what I will do, I will disable color and category and add one more bookmark and rename as model. Now the third one, only I'll keep color and these two need to be disabled and I'll add a bookmark and I'll say rename here as color. Now I'm done. So I'll close all this and I'll go to insert and in the button navigator and I'll say add navigator. If you see these all three buttons are automatically added or mapped with the bookmark. So the bookmark which I have created, three bookmark, category, model and color already mapped. Now what I'm going to do, I'll increase the size, color and if I'll click on the model and I'll increase the size of the model. category I'll increase the size of category so now if I'll click on the category I'll able to see category if I'll click on the model I will able to see the model and if I'll click on the color I'll able to see the color earlier there will be the you have to carry it a three buttons and map each button with the bookmark so all this struggle is over now so it's very easy so this button has a some feature like shape if you want to give the some another shape like hexagon you can see it change the shape of the button has been changed so there will be the rotation you can if you want to rotate the shape or the button you can do this and there will be the styling lot of options are available fill color back color and everything grid layout horizontal vertical you know you can whatever you want to do like you know is now vertical let me make it horizontal okay in the journal you can see the properties titles and everything so please try to explore so that's all for this video uh, thank you for watching please subscribe to our channel